Hey everybody, welcome back to another Redstone Showcase video. Um, this is, um, a showcase partly on, um, random number generating. And also, um, this, uh, crazy disco hallway that I was, um, making. Um, and the concept is is that I want like lights to light up in at a random time so 50% of the time this light has of uh, turning up. and the way that this works is that um so this will detect five different slots okay so five slots the comparator if it's all the way full here I'll show you um, down here if the hoppers all the way full let's say with um so with three axes, it'll go um, three blocks, and that is due to it taking up one fifth of the slots. Now, if we add four in, that signal gets stronger, and it should go twelve. So with this demonstration, you should be able to see it now. So with four axes, it goes twelve. With three axes, it goes nine. Two axes, it goes six, and so on. Um. And that's basically how it works. Yeah. Um, so, so when you spit one of these out, it's only like one sixty-fourth of one um thing of one slot. So it doesn't even light up two. So you see, this redstone will always be lit up. Now this redstone will be lit up fifty percent of the time. And that's how it'll activate. So that's the basic concept. Um, now I'm going to show you how to make one of these random number generators. So basically you need a hopper, uh, or a, a dispenser, or a dropper, either one, into a hopper. And now what this does is when you put a diamond axe, every time you turn on this hop, um, let's lock this here, every time you turn on this dropper, It'll spit one of the two out, but it should be exactly 50%. So then you want to lay a redstone into it and then into a uh, clock like this. It can go right here if you only want one, but it can also, it has to go here if you want um, like an array for it to uh, consistently uh, go across several, you know what I'm saying? Um, if you only want one, then, then you do that. And then you have to uh, get a comparator here. Let's see, where's... I'm not even in the right part. <laughs> okay. So you want to grab a comparator here. Two, three. And so if you put... Um, like here, we'll put a piston at the end, so then you can see it better. Um, can we have it facing up? And can we put, there we go. Okay. So now, once we activate this, oh, uh, you also need it to be at like um something like that. So then, um, because if you do it, if you have it going too quick, then the hopper will fill up. You see, like fifty percent of the time, it should be going up. There you go. Um, but if you actually want to run it into a wire, like uh, here, there's a few ways you can do it um, with these pistons into the. Um, uh, what are they? Observers? You can also send it into a block, but you can't send it right into the redstone lamp because that'll uh, um, light up those as well. So you need it to be kind of more um, just one block each. So you have to send it into, into a block before you can send it into an actual um, lamp but yeah so like you would have it um, you'd have to have it something more like this so it runs the repeater runs into the light if you want it to have it light up so that was um, my redstone showcase on this uh, disco uh, disco hallway um, and I just wanted to share that out because I think it's pretty cool um, but the main part to take away from this is that you can have a random number generator out of this, and that
that can help you with uh, different games and stuff. So like if you had it, um, uh, or something like where it comes out of here, um, and then a comparator here, and we have the redstone signal into a block and on top. But we can, uh, how do I do this? But we can take. So, it, like, if it goes into a repeater here, and then into a comparator, and then you have that go and subtract from it. So, if it's on subtract mode, then it'll all, it should only go two. Um, it shouldn't hit that third one unless um unless it goes uh, three blocks. So that's how you can separate it into. Uh, two different signals, so then that won't activate unless it goes all the way over. And so like you could you could set something up like that. I don't know. But use your imagination, but you could use it to um like with two to like sixteen, fifteen, I don't know. But you could you could randomly generate as many different um combinations as you want. So um that's all I wanted to showcase. Um Thank you guys for watching. I'll uh, I'll give you a nice side view of this. Um, by the way, it's completely stackable, so you could have one of these next to another, and this works because um, because it'll only go three blocks. So if it went more than three blocks, it wouldn't work because no matter how many times, it's like the, this. If it it'll light up um, when that one lights up, but if it's here. No matter how many times we let this go, this will never light up unless you put another uh, dropper here, which makes it um, completely stackable. So yeah, thank you everybody for watching. Um, I just uh, wanna let you guys know about some of my some of this knowledge. Uh, thank you for watching, and I'll uh, I'll see you next time. I gotta deactivate this or it'll be really laggy. But, uh, bye.